pick you in. It was a little bittersweet not to be able to finish off that sweep, I guess. Yeah, uh, a tough weekend. Um, got two wins early and we're going for the sweep today and unfortunately uh, didn't execute well enough to win the game today. Uh, credit goes to their senior pitcher, Roby, and, and their senior uh, Greenwood. Had, had the big hit there that, that broke it open for them. Um, but I like the way our team fought. I like the way we battled. Reagan Spencer did a heck of a job in the circle. Um, they capitalized on some opportunities, and, and we just hit a couple of atom balls um, with, with runners in scoring position and, and just didn't capitalize in those key situations. Um, we're going to take this weekend and learn from it and get ready for the Gamecocks on Wednesday. What's the biggest thing you've learned about this team through the first three ACC series, I guess? Well, I think we have a lot of fight. We obviously are, are very strong in the circle. You know, we have options to go to, um, Millie, Reagan, Obviously, Valerie, um, Brooke McCubbin has, has seen some innings, so we like our pitching staff and what they're doing. They're keeping us in games and giving us every opportunity to win. Um, we're, we're learning how to battle and, and manufacture runs and situational hit against good good pitching. And for the most part, our defense is, is short up and we're playing much better defensively. And, you know, the biggest thing now is just getting the timely hits and, and building off of this, you know, series win for for next week yeah you mentioned roby uh was anything that you guys learned from her seeing her on friday and that you sort of knew coming in she's against her tough. you know she's she's got a, a, a good screwball um she's got a lot of upspin so um but nothing we haven't seen we, we saw her last year you know she's the same pitcher she's just tough she's mm -hmm. a competitor and uh, we just didn't didn't get the big hits off her today what did you think made her so effective today in particular you know i think she got herself out of some jams and uh you know she didn't really walk anybody and and their defense you know they had four errors but their defense mm -hmm. made some plays when they needed to make plays yeah um do you think this team's sort of still getting used to getting everybody's best shot. You guys aren't really a secret anymore. Everybody knows who Clemson is. I mean, is that something you guys still are trying to get used to, you think? I think no, I think we're I think we're used to it. I think definitely our, our, our schedule is challenged just this year. We've played a very tough schedule and and certainly um, you know we've lost some close games and today was another one where we still gave ourselves chance in the seventh inning, you know, with the winning run at the plate. And as a coach that's really all you can ask for is that fight in your team. Yeah. Where does the offensive improvement need to come, particularly with, with runners on on base? I just yeah. think, you know, as you saw in that last battle, he is battling. Mm -hmm. You know, the inning before we, we start the inning with two line drive outs, you know, and sometimes that's the way the ball bounces, you know. I think we just still got to be aggressive uh, early in counts and look to hit against good pitching. Yeah, that decision to send Aliyah home, I guess, at the end, bottom of the sixth, bottom of the seventh, you just trying to make Louisville make a play there? No, I, I mean, it was a tough decision. I thought the ball actually got away okay. from her a little farther and she got it a little quicker. I thought it, it bounced off her and, and uh, certainly was thinking if we get a run there in the bottom of the seventh, Valerie goes in and shuts him out. But, uh, you know, I definitely wish I would have had that one back. But, yeah. uh, you know, as a coach, you, you go with what you see and, and that's what I saw in sending her. Yeah.